Well, we have a treat this morning for our announcements. Lisa Costantino is going to share a brief story. Many of you are getting our emails or our texts and know that today is the launching of the Vision Tour. And if you don't know what the Vision Tour is, Lisa's going to share that with you. It's a four-week introduction to the Vision, Values, Mission, and Membership here at Manoa. And Lisa went through the last class, and so I wanted her just to share a little bit about her experience, and then I might even ask her a few questions. So why don't we welcome Lisa as she shares her story. Is this on? Yeah. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. So it's kind of ironic that almost 12 months ago was the first time that I walked through these doors at, at the church. And I joined, where actually I came in because it's close to my house, it's Protestant, and they put the time on the, the marquee. And I'm a CPA, so all of that fits in what I need in order to walk through the doors, and I did. And it's not a really compelling reason to join a church at that point, but I really enjoyed the fellowship, the small group meeting, and the people I met, and that was enough for me. But in this church, you have to go through a course in order to join, which I thought was kind of odd. And you know, I like the first minister, Stephan, you're doing a great job, if anybody hasn't told you that recently, and I, yeah, I enjoyed right. that, and, and I was ready to join, but I had to go through this course, so I said, that's great. It's a great course. It's a four-week course where you'll learn the values, the beliefs, and the missions of this church, and what we stand for, and what we're trying to accomplish. But for me, you know, if, if you are a member of the church, it's your first time here, or if you've been coming, I would strongly encourage that you go through there, because it's great information. But what I learned for me was not only that information, because I was already ready to join. I learned that I didn't select this church. I was led here. And this is where God intended me to be. So when I read those vows and they were read to us and we had to accept it, I knew in my heart that this is where I should be. That's great. Thank you so much. So what would you tell to somebody who is sitting here this morning and saying, I don't know, I'm not sure I want to take this. What would be an encouragement for them um, if you were in that same spot? What do you think? Well, I think, you know, again, the information that you're, you're here and if you listen to your heart and as it unfolds of what you'll learn, you'll hear and you'll be told, I think, by God that you should be here. And if you don't hear and you go through the course and you think you should be somewhere else and that's where God is leading you to be, then that's where you should be. Amen. And we should be in the right spot. Amen. Thank you, Lisa. Sure. Wonderful.